I think that we are absolutely in the midst of a fourth industrial revolution. We're on the precipice of a decade of change that's emerging. It's not about machines automating away work. I think it's about machines complementing and augmenting how work is actually accomplished. What pushes me personally is this opportunity for software to enable how work gets accomplished in a safer manner, in a manner that enables people to make better decisions with data at their fingertips. What more could you ask for when you wake up in the day to go to work? I'm George Matthew. I'm CEO and Chairman of Kespri. Kespri is a leader in aerial intelligence products. We have a fully autonomous product. We draw the area that the drone flies, we hit the start button, and the drone autonomously takes off and collects image-based analysis. That data is automatically brought into our cloud infrastructure where we stitch all the 2D images into a fully rendered 3D model. We then layer an artificial intelligence around that digital twin, and we expose all that as applications to the users that serve multiple industries. We see a tremendous amount of similarities to the ethos that Casper has, to what ABB has built, and with the digitization that Casper has been historically focused in. To be able to combine those two together in terms of ABB equipment and products combined with Casper capability, that's where we see opportunities, particularly on an industry by industry basis. I would define future of Kespri as like just opening up the platform more, but going even beyond drones. So if you have a rover that is creating visual data or you have fixed cameras, so be kind of like opening up in every layer of the product so that people can find richer value out of the data that they're collecting. The possibility is endless because visual data is really becoming the key and center of how people are making their decisions now. If we look at where ABB's work has been threaded as well as the entire world has been moving towards smarter cities, what's really incredible is that it's all sensors. In all of these cases, we have an opportunity to combine all this sensor data together to make better decisions on traffic, on pollution, on congestion. We think that that's a tremendous opportunity that's in the market that Casper, ABB, and others will continue to play in how smart city solutions emerge over the next decade.